Are you tired of making pig food but never knowing exactly how much of each ingredient you need to put into the pen to satisfy their needs? Well, you could use the pig food production by Omatana. You only need four ingredients for each of the recipes. But what if I told you there was another mod that you only needed one ingredient to make pig food? That's right, with a modernized flour mill from Adub Modding and the ABP team, you're only gonna need to put one ingredient in here. Once you get the mod downloaded and your game started, you're going to come here into construction. Then you're going to go here to production. All right. And then you're going to go down to factories. And you're going to go across until you see the modernized flour mill right here. Now it does cost a hundred thousand dollars and you are able to spin it around anywhere you like. What you need to pay attention to is right here on the front. You've got your dump off point and your pickup point right here. hundred thousand dollars put down if you don't need to do any terraforming at all. And it's pretty simple, the two points, once again, the drop-off point right here where all of your ingredients go, and then your pickup right here. Now let's go ahead and take a look here at the recipes. And as you can see right off the bat, you are gonna be able to make a ton of different types of flour. But the really interesting thing is, if you look at the very last thing that's gonna be a byproduct, is you're gonna get pig food. Yes, so here with wheat flour, right? You're gonna be able to put wheat in, you're gonna get flour, you're gonna get chaff, for some reason, you're gonna get stones and you're gonna get pig food as well. And all of these have different recipes all the way down. The one that I found that appears to be the best is gonna be your corn flour right here. It only takes 24 corn and you're gonna get 60 pig food out of each cycle. But you might be wondering, well, exactly how much are you gonna get every single month out of this thing? Well, a regular cornfield, all right? If you don't do anything to it at all, it's full of weeds, and you don't put any lime, you don't put any fertilizer, anything like that. Per hectare, you're gonna get 9,200 liters of corn off of that hectare of ground. Whenever you run it through here, you're gonna be able to get a total of 23,000 pig food off every single hectare if you don't do anything to the field at all. If you got it at a full 100% yield, you're gonna get 46,000 liters of pig food. And you're also going to get 46,000 liters of everything else as well, guys. You're going to get flour. You're going to get your chaff. You're going to get your stones and the pig food. Guys, that's 132,000 liters of product out of only 18,400 liters of corn. That's insane. And some of you might be saying, but driver, I need six liters of diesel for every single one of those cycles. Yeah, you do on this recipe. But if you come down here and you take a look a little bit farther down, you can use electric charge also, or you can use methane. For those of you that are running BGAs, I think some of you already have these things that you just kind of sell off, right, for a profit. Well, now you can use them to help make your pig food and these other things as well. But what if you're not running a BGA and you have to figure out how you're going to come up with diesel, methane, or electric charge? Well this right here. You've got the fuel refinery by Zottelzoct. And guys, there's a way that you can actually get free electrical charge with this. And to put it on your map, you're going to come here into construction. It's going to be right next to your other factory that you just put down. And it's going to look like this right here. Now it's going to cost you 125,000. It is a little bit more expensive, but guys, this thing is, I think it's going to pay for itself pretty quickly. And, and you're going to be able to get a lot of different things out of this, depending what all you do on your farm. And let me show you what I mean. We're going to come right here into our recipes. We click here. And the first thing that you can see is electric charge by air. Yes, it costs you absolutely nothing to get 25 electric charge 600 times a month. That's going to be a total of 15,000 uh, units of electrical charge that you can get every single month absolutely free. So the way it works, you see those uh, turbines up there on the top. If I come back in here and I turn this recipe on, well, now they're spinning and I'm getting electrical charge. All right. And all I have to do whenever I come back in here is go over to my electrical charge down here on the bottom. And instead of spawning, what I want to do is I want to distribute. Now that's going to send it over to my other factory. Now there is going to be a little bit of a cost associated with this, but it's, it's just, it's going to automatically go over there, right? At the top of every hour, it's just going to shoot itself over there. You've, it's like you've got an invisible wire. Other ways that you can get your electrical charge is you could use methane to get it or diesel. And you might be wondering, well, how in the world do I get some diesel? Well, there's recipes right here where you can get methane and diesel 
and more pig food, guys. Canola, sunflowers, soybeans, olives, sugar cane, cut sugar beet, potatoes. You're all going to be able to get pig food as a byproduct here to make some diesel and methane to be able to power the other plant to use some of your other grains. So let's say you've got, I don't know, a bunch of canola or something. You did a contract, right? We'll bring it over here, throw it into this. You're going to be able to make you a ton of diesel and you're going to be able to get you some pig food out of this thing. And you're going to be able to get some compost. Now, this isn't the most uh, beneficial, right? You're losing quite a bit here, right? You're only getting 700 units of stuff out of a thousand liters of your uh, crop. So I would probably stay away from this if you're trying to make pig food. What I would do though, is come down here and take a look at wood chips. For every thousand liters of wood chips, you're going to be able to get 25 liters of diesel, five units of of methane and then 800 liters of compost you're gonna be able to sell that compost off straight right or if you've got a bga that accepts it you can turn that back into maybe more electric things like that but that's awesome cut down a bunch of trees make you a bunch of diesel and methane and then use that in your other facility over here to be able to actually power this factory right you you've got a diesel recipe right here you've got an electrical charge recipe right here and you've got a methane recipe right here so by using these two mods in conjunction with each other i mean you could absolutely run just the the wind right here like i said now to run a full uh recipe over here in the grain mill on any of those recipes it takes six units um, and it's 3,600 per month. So that's going to be 21,600 total that you're going to need. And one of these is only going to make you 15,000. So it's only going to run about three quarters of a month. And then it's going to start back over right at the beginning of the next month. So if you're trying to make this for the entire year, just kind of plan that out. Right. Or like I said, get some wood chips or get some other grains or something from another contract, throw in here, run one of those other recipes where you get some diesel and then run that diesel recipe over there as well. I mean, guys, I know that this right here is going to cost you $225,000 to actually put down on your farm. But I, I believe that you are going to be able to make some money back really quick on this, especially if you take that chaff and you turn it into some silage or you, you take it over to your BGA, your stones, be able to make that into lime that you could sell or you could make it into lime that you could just use on your plant, save some money there or your farm, save some money there. And I mean, your diesel, just, just sell the diesel, right? Sell it outright or, or, you know, the flour, you're, you're going to be making all that flour. And for those of you that really want to make money super fast, I just mentioned flour, right? We'll check out this recipe right here. Um, you want some bread? Okay. Two liters of flour is going to make 30 units of bread or, or you, you come down here in cakes, right? That's, it's usually the whole recipe, right? You need two flour, two sugar, two milk, two eggs, two butter, and two strawberries. That's going to make you a cake. Not anymore. Right here. Two flour makes 30 cakes. Yep. I, I don't know how. I don't know why. So take your diesel and your flour that you're getting made in these two buildings right here. Make 30 cakes with it, and you are going to make so much money while you're making pig food.